So 33 days ago the Mirage Prime Access Pack arrived. With this is the Prime Accessories. Unfortunately it doesn't really hover over that and put the attachments on which would be a nice touch. So when you clicked on it it didn't just open it in a different window and it showed you the actual attachments. In this comes the 90 day credit and affinity boosters, the Mirage Prime Glyph Pack, the Atavist Prime Armor and the Abera Prime Sandana. And to be fair, this armor itself, I'll admit, it looks pretty nice. If I wasn't going to pick this up for the boosters alone, I still would have picked this up because the armor does look really nice, even down to the leg pieces here, which we'll get a closer look at in a minute. But the Sandana itself also looks pretty nice. If I go to the Arsenal thing, I'll be able to spin it round and it's not too long, it doesn't drag across the floor, which can ruin a lot of sandanas. And it just, in general, looks way nicer than a lot of, I don't want to say recent prime sandanas, because most prime sandanas do look pretty nice. And if I set this to the default colours, you'll actually be able to see it a little bit better. And the gold parts look pretty nice. To be fair though, my favourite of all the Prime Sandanas is still got to be, I keep wanting to call it the Noru, the one that came with, it is the Noru, Ugh, that's kind of glitched through, the standard one for Rhino Prime when Rhino Prime came out, until this actually returned and then, well, I like this one a lot. I was loving the, I think it was, I've forgotten his name, Limbo Prime? He had a really good one, and I wish I could remember the name of these, but there is so many sandanas these days. It is just so many sandanas. I think it was that one, yes. That was my favourite. I think this one, mainly because with the kind of colour combinations I have on Mirage Prime, that looks pretty nice. And the armour, you can see what I mean about the leg pieces here. It's a shame that the rings don't move, but I think because of the angle they're at, if they did move, kind of like the bits on the helmet here, if they did move, it would have actually ruined it. The attachments, of course, the Atavist Prime, the chest plates, the shoulder plates, the leg plates, all look pretty nice, but if, if you see if I take it off, the normal part of the knee by itself still look pretty nice, but works really well in conjunction with these. So this Prime Access was kind of worth actually picking up because it looked much, much better than some of the other ones. There hasn't been really a bad Prime Access for a while, it's just the only way to get these is through the Prime Access. And when she leaves in about two months, all these accessories will of course leave with her and they won't come back until a prime unvaulting in the future and I really am liking that sandana. Okay the dangly parts I know they are actually part of that's not what I was looking for the actual frame the danglies on the the waist there if they were part of the sandana I think that might be a little bit overkill it's just it's subtle but you can see what I mean about the rings on this the kind of move on the leg pieces it might just be a little bit overkill if they moved as well having it move on the sandana way more important and to be fair I know it's kind of weird to say but the attachments and the sandana I tend to leave these on the prime that they come with these days rather than move them around because they seem to be more suited towards the frame that they actually come on and that just looks the shoulder pieces look really nice next to the targus prime i think this has got to be one of my favorite hydroids was kind of a eh it's just kind of a prime armor set these look pretty nice on any frame there are of course many different ways to try and justify this picking this up costs real world money and before anybody's jumped to the comment section no I bought this myself it was not sent to me I do this because the exclusive side of it is 
an incentive by itself, but the boosters on top of that make it much easier to level up weapons. I do wish the 90 day boosters, you could choose between the four to the two that you want, because I would love to have a resource and affinity, but I've had these things running basically constantly since the Ember Prime Access was added. And to be fair without them, <laughs> it would just, it would be a much harder to level things up quickly and it just saves me a bit of time leveling weapons up so that's kind of my justification for it but really the completionist in me just won't let me not pick up the prime accessories whether it's actually worth it or not this time around i would say yes because they do look pretty nice oberon's sandana was nice necros's accessories were nice Banshee's accessories were also nice. They do do a lot of nice armor, nice sandana. Hydroids, the last one, which is the only reason I'm doing this one because I got asked so many times why I didn't cover Hydroids. They, well, they were just kind of, they still looked nice, but they were much more bland to what a lot of the prime accessories in the past have been. So I completely forgot about it until Mirage Prime came around and then went, Oh, I never did cover those, did I? Probably never will, unless they return in the future and then I might, but more than likely, probably not. So, justifying these for yourself, there are, I know a lot of people would like these because they are nice looking accessories, but it's just a case of, you don't need these. Mirage Prime, the Kogaki Prime and the... AK Balto or the Ak Balto, I get wrong no matter how I pronounce it, so I'll just do both, it's easier. They're still available within the game, you don't need to buy them through Prime Access, so splitting the Prime accessories off as a separate entity, I like that since the day they did that. If they hadn't of, I don't think I would actually be picking up the Prime accessories every time. I probably still would, but it would be way more expensive so mm, probably by now I would have stopped doing that maybe it all just depends on whether you can justify it but these do look really nice anyway we'll leave these off here for now thanks for watching and I'll catch you next time